Andrew here with Wrench Dyg Tools. In this video, we're going to be crimping and assembling Aptive, previously known as Delphi, WeatherPack series terminals. Now, WeatherPack terminals are sealed, weatherproof automotive electrical connectors. They're ideal as they are durable and heavily used in the automotive and transportation industries, and I highly recommend them for automotive aftermarket use. Okay, a real quick recap of the PEW12 tool frame. This tool frame has a parallel, parallel crimp action, so it's up and down, not scissor-like with the competition. So with this parallel action, it produces 1.2 metric tons of force at the point of crimp. So you know you're getting a durable quality crimp. Okay, so with this tool, we have a die set, a locator, and a wire stop. These are all gonna help us in the process of crimping these terminals. So now let's get to the contacts. So here are the, these are the connectors, the Delphi Weatherpack connector housings. You can see the waterproof seal on there. We've got our wire and we've got our terminals and our seals. So first what we'll do is we're gonna put our seal on the wire. with just a little bit of insulation sticking out. We'll do this on both. Okay, now we're ready to crimp. So we will open up the tool. Now what this has, this has actually a locator that holds this contact into place. So what I will do is I will insert it into the correct channel. You can see that it's actually holding it into the correct place. I can move it. I've even got it upside down. Look at that. It stays in the right place. This isn't, a, this isn't a job requiring three hands like many. Okay. So now we get the wire and the cable. Insert it as such. Give it a full crimp. And voila, we have a beautiful crimp. Seal and contact at the same time. Note that it's not a two-step process like with the Delphi repair type crimpers, which also require soldering. No soldering required here. Okay, let's do the next one. So we open it back up. Sometimes you have to look at what you're doing. <laughs> That always helps. Okay. Then we insert our contact and seal. We crimp. And beautiful. You've got another perfectly crimped seal and contact. So our next step is we will get the contact housing. As such, this is the female housing. What we'll do is we will insert it. until we hear a click. Perfect, then we do the other one. Perfect. Now this, this is actually a retainer that keeps the wire from con coming out. Now there's already a retainer in built into the contact, but this is an additional, so if, if there's any pull or movement on this, it keeps it keeps it inside. So what we'll, we'll do is we'll snap that shut. Perfect, there we go, all done. So that's the female. Now we'll do the male. We always want to make sure we're doing, of course, the correct alignment. So when this was clipped together, it is yellow to yellow and there we go, yellow to yellow and white to white. So we insert the wire. Here our snap and insert our other wire. Now we close with the retainer. And you can actually see, there's actually the, the seals inside of there. You can see how that's gonna keep it waterproof there. And then we also have the waterproof seal on the outside. So now we will assemble it and we are good to go. And there we have a beautiful connector assembly, Delphi Weather Pack, the Wrench Dyke PEW12 tool. You can find these online or through our distributors. You can find out more information at www.wrnstig.com. R-E-N-N-S-T-E-I-G 
www.ufcpodcast.us. Thank you for your time.